Hello, I'm Michael Maggiano. For over 40 years, I have been a trial lawyer for all people. We at Maggiano, DiGirolamo, and Lizzie strongly condemn bias, hatred, racism, and discrimination in all forms. This past Sunday afternoon, in response to what has happened in Atlanta, over 800 citizens attended a rally at Hyler Park in Tenafly to share their grief and stand in solidarity with the Asian American community. The poster said, stop Asian hate. Hate is a virus and God hates hate. Asian Americans are an integral part of our community. They are our school children, our neighbors, hardworking business people, and caring professionals. Many Asian Americans fill our hospitals and nursing homes as frontline caregivers treating our ill. The irony is that while they put themselves in harm's way, for all of us, they cannot walk down Main Street without having the fear of assault in the back of their minds. Unfortunately, I think that one of the things that you know, racism has been doing to Asians is just reducing human beings to a single virus, which we're not. So I wanted to you know, make it visual, make it clear that I am you know, an individual with feelings and I'm proud of my heritage and my culture and I don't want us to be ridiculed like that anymore. Asian Americans are Americans in the same way we all are, bringing a unique and lively diversity to our community. It is the diversity of our people that really makes America great. It is the fundamental creed we all share, the driving force behind a free nation, and makes us stand head and shoulders above all other nations. I've asked my friend, colleague, and associate, Unmi Huang, to share her thoughts as an Asian American professional. America as a nation should commit itself to supporting its Asian communities. The Asian American should take on the responsibility of speaking up, reporting incidents to the authorities, and making an acknowledgement to the community that someone did something because of bias. The Center for the Study of Hate and Extremism at California State University released findings in early March. They showed hate crimes against Asian Americans spiked 149 percent between 2019 and 2020, even though hate crimes overall declined. A separate group, Stop AAPI Hate, AAPI stands for Asian American and Pacific Islander, reported that there were nearly 3,800 hateful incidents during the first year of the pandemic. These numbers are likely a small fraction of actual incident, including crimes, because Asian Americans are less likely to seek help for many reasons, including language barrier and cultural differences. These numbers tell us clearly and unfortunately that there is an increasing trend in anti-Asian hate when we all have suffered from the pandemic, when we all have struggled with COVID-19, when we all have ever needed each other's care and support to get through this hard time. Please do your part. We Asian Americans must become representatives at the forefront of these issues to bring awareness and encourage justice for such acts of hate. We should stand up together our history has shined when we stand together. We should treat all people fairly, equally, and respectfully. So let us all work to stop the hate now. Thank you. Thank you. Hate is the virus! 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 Hate is the virus!